Hey guys, Tom here. Now I wanna talk about conversations and focusing on what doesn't change. One question that I get all the time is what platform is better for lead generation? Is it YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, an array of other things I've never actually heard of. But we wanna think about what are, the, what are the main things that don't change no matter what platform we have? Because that means if one of the platforms is no longer working, it gets shut down or something taken out of our control happens, we still have control of our lead generation. So the number one thing that I see or will never change is conversations. The way we have conversations with people to get them onto a call. So if we're, if we're trying to get leads, we're trying to get clients, we need a way to have conversations. Now, there's two things that happen when I look at people's conversations when, they, when it's not working for them. It's firstly, they're not asking the right questions, which sounds obvious, but secondly, they're also asking the wrong questions, which also probably sounds obvious. But what we wanna do, like having a conversation with a prospect is like a game of chess. We need to know the moves three, four, five steps ahead. So if you're asking a question for the sake of it, you don't know the next move, then you're pretty much screwed. And then you wonder why your conversations aren't working or you're not getting people on calls. You can blame the prospects and think they're not the right people, but the chances are you're just not doing the right process. So when I talk about the, this side of it, where we go, we're not having the right conversations, we're not asking the right questions. If you ask somebody a question that's not very good and you get a not very good answer, what do you do? You just have to keep going back with other dumb questions. So we're gonna make sure that the questions we're asking we know the variables of the answers they're gonna give us. Like as an example, real simple here, if we say to somebody, are you exercising at the moment? We know the answer is gonna be yes or no, give or take. So we need to know where we go from a yes answer and where we go from a no answer. And this is like building out a structure of your conversations. If we ask a question to say, how's your day going? Who knows what they're gonna say? Sometimes you'll get big stories, sometimes you'll get good things, like there is no response answer to that so we can't ask silly questions or questions we don't want a response to we have to go down this other path and go i'm about to ask this question these are the variables of what they're going to say back to me these is this is my response either direction and then we need to plan that out and know exactly where we're going to go i'm not sure if that made a lot of sense to you but the number one reason that people's businesses aren't growing online is they're not having enough guided conversations or they're not guiding the conversations to sales calls. So they say, my sales is good, I just can't get enough people on calls. That's how we get people on calls. The sales starts way before we get them on the call. We have to have this conversation with them earlier to find out what it is that they want, what it is that they're struggling with, what it is that you can help them with. But it has to be in a, a conversation structure to guide them to where you want them to be. So if you're having trouble getting people on calls, have a look through some of your messengers, your messages that you've had with people, no matter what platform, because it makes no difference. Have a look at the platform, the conversations that you've been having with people, go back through and see, <laughs> you'll be embarrassed and disgusted at what you've been saying to people, because it's quite a, it's quite an art, um, but you will, you'll be embarrassed at yourself. Like, have a look at the conversations that you've been having and see what you could do better and improve on it. If you are an A player and want to do well with your business, you need to reflect on the actions that you've been taking. So go back, have a look at those conversations, map out what you need to do better, start working on your conversations, not just having conversations.